if you happen to see a few unidentified flying objects in the skies over the next few days, don't be alarmed. They're just part of one major Miami Valley event going on this weekend outside the Air Force Museum. New at 530, Jordan Burgess is live to explain how it can help the local economy take flight. Well, to see these things in the sky is pretty amazing. Now, they may look small to some, but there's no doubt their impact is big. In the home of the brave. From the sounds of it, this is a big event. This is hollow ground. I mean, this is birthplace of aviation. Which is appropriate because the planes themselves look like newborns. And in a way, they are these guys' babies, but their sounds and speeds are all grown up. Flies about 160 mile an hour. Welcome to the Dayton Air Show. Not that Dayton Air Show. This one is a chance for the smaller planes to get some air time. We just put, put some music on in the background and let the guys go out there and throw one down. But in this air show, the pilots stay grounded. They let their fingers do the flying. I'm having a great time. It's just another fun weekend. And don't let the small planes fool you. They attract a big crowd, about 15,000 people in all. Dayton area is a hotbed for RC community. That's radio control to people in the know, like Joe, who came all the way from Pennsylvania to pilot his plane. Visitors like him are already propelling the economy with their purchases. Oh yeah, you're going to get it. You already got it this morning when I had to fill my tank up. <laughs> but these pilots will have their eyes on the skies for a different reason this weekend with the possibility for rain. With Isaac moving in this, this weekend, crowds are going to be down a little bit, but uh, we're having a good time. But some wouldn't miss this for the world, like Rick, who's been coming for 13 years. It's almost like a family reunion. Everybody you see once or twice a year, and it's just a good time by all. Because it's not the size of the plane in the flight, but the size of the flight in the plane. We've got a lot of high, expensive, high-tech uh, airplanes that love the runway. All this big, beautiful airplane. Now, if you want to go, the show is free, and you can catch it tomorrow and Sunday between 8 and 5 outside the Air Force Museum. Reporting live, Jordan Burgess, 2 News.